Hey guys, this is Francisco Hernandez of FGH Photography, or as some of you guys know me by Joey. And today I'm going to show you how I would sharpen a photo in Photoshop. And this photo actually origin, uh, was originally sharper, but I applied just a little bit of Gaussian blur just to show you how I would correct the sharpness. And actually before I even start any sharpening, um, what you guys should realize is that the resolution of the photo, you know, it's kind of big. Let me see if I can bring up the... Yep, here's the how big the photo is. And the size plays a huge factor because if you sharpen the photo when it's huge, when you start to resize it down to, let's say, uh, a Facebook resolution size, which is like 2048 pixels at the longest edge, um, it's going to look a lot sharper than it, re than it really is. Um, one thing that I've told a lot of people before and I've heard before is um, everything small looks good. And that is basically because... I don't know, just a whole bunch of different factors. But for this case, I just wanted to explain that the photo was big to begin with. So when I apply sharpness and I resize it down, it's going to look really good. So yeah, uh, the first thing I would do is I would hit Control J, or if you're on a Mac, Command J. And I'm going to, um, this layer is basically going to serve the purpose for becoming a bit of sharpening. And to do that, you're going to hit Filter, you're going to go to Other, you're going to go to High Pass. And depending on uh, on your image size, you're going to change the different levels. I'm not going to tell you, you know, do a, a radius of two. It's not going to work for everybody. It depends on the size of your image. So this image, I'm going to, I'm going to probably be, you want, you want just a bit, little bit of uh, lines to show up. You don't want anything like, let's see, like that. You don't want that. It's, that's not good. <laughs> so you want something like very visible. Like she's basically like, I don't know, so it's called stencil art. I don't know. Um, yeah, something around this kind of look, um, because all this stuff that you're seeing right now is basically the sharpness that's going to be applied. If your photo is really out of focus, you're going to have to do, you know, your level is probably going to be somewhere like over here, and then that would probably help you out. You know, just experiment with it. So I'm going to start with maybe, I'll probably keep it at 1.4, see how that works. And then after that, you're going to change the blending mode of that layer to let's see overlay and yeah it kind of got a little bit um weird but it did sharpen the photo so this is how it looked like before and this is after the sharpening before after and actually i'm gonna get another i mean you can i could um copy this layer here i'm, I'm gonna just add like two two more layers so you guys can see what's going on it's gonna be sharpening the photo extra Con control j okay i don't know why it gave me that little ping but control j Okay, I don't know why the ping again, but okay, so this is the amount of sharpening that was applied. So this is with no sharpness applied. One level, two level, three level. And um, I guess for, the, you know, so far, sometimes when you extra sharpen a photo and then you resize it down, it looks fine. So I'm going to see how that works. And um, when I resize, I've been talking about resizing the image, but what I mean is that I like to resize, resize my images for, for Facebook. For online so what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna go to image and I've, I show this in another video image size and then the height is the longest edge so I'm gonna hit 2048 and now it's um, resized down so you know let's see I'm gonna go to 100% so this is how the photo looks like and this is how it looked like blurry I guess Oh, not come. Not, that's what I meant to hit. I meant to group these. Okay, so um, let's see. Whoa. Okay, there you go. So let's blur. I, I'm actually at 200%. So this is at 100%. So this is 100%. Or this is at uh, the blurry version, and this is sharpened version. Blurry version, sharpened version. So yeah, that's it basically. So um, if you enjoy the video, let me know. If not, you know, then you didn't enjoy the video. But yeah, the secret is pretty much the high pass filter. So there you go. Hope you guys enjoyed the video.